Hey guys, welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be breaking down the easiest step-by-step -step Jason nail art from Friday the 13th. And it's gonna glow in the dark. Okay, so first things first, we're starting with the Cosmic Cat Eye gel color for the base. I'm using Getting Galactic. This is our red cat eye. After I hit the left, the right, and the bottom, I'm gonna go ahead and cure that in the light. And now I'm gonna go over top of that using Bloodbath Jelly. I went ahead and cured that red, and now we're gonna use an unreleased holographic black. We're going to paint one third of the nail, and using my As If Ombre brush, I'm just gonna lightly feather that black down onto the red. This brush makes ombre so easy. I'm gonna go ahead and cure that in the light and then I just decided to do another pass of that black because I really wanted it to be really dark at the top. Brushes I'm gonna be using is the Deadly Detailer brush, nine millimeter brush, and the ombre brush. Also, look at this brush case. Now we're just gonna start by using a white liner gel and I'm using the Deadly Detailer brush and we're gonna draw a long lowercase T shape. I have seen so many Jason tutorials and the proportion for a lot of them is always off. So pay attention to the length that I'm doing for the top and the bottom of the head. We're gonna hump out to connect the top of the T and then we're gonna do the same thing for the bottom. Pay close attention to how much the lines are curved. This is going to be crucial to how your nail ends up looking in the end. Everything that I'm using in this video is from my brand as always and you guys can see everything I use in the description below. After we've drawn it out, I'm just gonna grab my white gel polish and we're gonna fill all that in and cure. Now we're gonna add some glow pigment. This is glow pigment number two, clear to aqua from my brand. We're gonna mix in some clear shiny top coat and cover the whole nail and then we're gonna cure that. After that's cured, grab your favorite dotting tool and now we're just going to be drawing out where his eyes are placed. Pay attention to how far down low this eye is and also how large it is. So his eyes are not perfect pupils because it's just a mask and these are just where the eye sockets are so you can start with doing two perfect circles but you can see that after i went in and right now i'm just gonna kind of make it uneven a little bit you don't want them to be too perfect now here you see me placing a tiny dot to map out where we're going to extend these two lines out that create a triangly part of the mask at the top above his eyes and just to note, I am doing these lines wiggly looking on purpose. Now we're going to place a dot right here. And this needs to be a really tiny, 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 small sideways oval. Then we're going to go ahead and fill that in. After we've done that, go ahead and cure it. We're going to go ahead and draw out these two sideways triangles that directly align with the inner part of the eye. Also pay attention to the angles of the lines when you're painting these triangles. This is gonna be such a cool nail art for spooky season, so definitely give this a try and tag me when you do. This is how it should be looking so far, or close to it. We're gonna take our dotting tool and do four dots on top of the triangle. Pay attention to the pattern and the placement of these dots, also the size. We're gonna do two directly above the last one. Now on each side above the eye to an angle, we're gonna do a pattern of three that form a triangle shape. And then we're gonna go ahead and do the same thing down here. Now for this pattern down here, we're just gonna do three dots. And we're gonna add a matching pair a little bit over to the right, right here. Could you believe it? More dots. So we're gonna add one, two, right here, and then two right here. Now taking, oops, I did it again, red liner gel, we're just gonna fill in all the triangles on his mask. Now we need to draw little straps. There's three of them on his mask. There's a tiny little square right up here for the top one. Fill that in and then we're gonna draw out one on the left right here, directly level to the eye and one right here on the right. Using some metal gel polish, I'm just gonna do three circles inside of all those squares. Now we can go ahead and outline the mask with the black liner gel. After that's said and done, this is how it should be looking so far. Now, if you wanna get real fancy, grab some shading gel. This one is from my brand. Now pay attention to where I lay this down. We're gonna do a swoop that swoops into the eye right here. Then we're gonna do a swoop that swoops into the nose and then a series of curved lines right down here. And then we're gonna just fill all that in. 
It literally made this nail so much cooler. Look at that, you guys. I love the consistency of the shading gel. If you have not tried it yet, definitely go get your hands on it. And are you ready for this? Look at how cool this came out, you guys. Oh, I am so happy that we finally have a Jason tutorial. And look, it glows in the dark. The best part. If you guys liked this little tutorial, make sure to give me a like, subscribe for more, and I will see you guys in the next video soon. Bye, guys.